I wouldn't come down in a boat like that. Where are you trying to go? That's not a good place to go fishing. It's just this the whole way. And below that is a bunch of class three rapids that you really are not geared up for. What about that? Where you park? Um, where are you parked? Uh, at the uh... lock six. Yeah. All right, go back to your car. Drive down. Wait, what about what about going around there? If you're gonna do that. Yeah, I mean, it's just a pain in the ass to get down there from where you are. You'd want to cross on the other island. And then giving you directions to get back is going to be interesting. So, the better place for you to fish at this level yeah. is below Little Falls. Because you can paddle up, and you, know, that's, you see people fishing there all the time, but if, with a boat, you can like cross over and, uh, and get there. So if you go back to your car, drive down to Lock 5, park there, walk down the trail, about a half mile and you'll see on the right a trail that's a very wide like you can drive a car down a trail and it goes to an observation deck you can put in there that's below little falls so you're below all the hazards and you'll see a shit ton of people fishing maybe yeah i was actually given instruction to go to lock five and then we drove to lock six and i was like you know it's probably fine yeah i mean the <laughs> It, right now it's class three, but at times it's class four. This this run starts up here, and it, we end at a lot five. But can I go around that way? Here's why I don't want to tell you yes. Two reasons. One, you guys don't have PFDs. Yeah. If you fall out of your boat out there, there are places where it's very deep. There are places where it's shallow. Neither of those is good for you. Um, it's not good not to have a PFD below lock five, to be blunt. It's actually a terrible idea because there are very strong down currents on some of the eddy lines. Yeah. Um, Wait, where's, where's she coming from? She just walked down this trail here from the top of this little channel. Oh yeah. And you should. Okay. There's a little trail right here. Yes, there's a trail right here. Sorry, that's what I'm suggesting is you walk back up. Thank you so much. Yes. The only thing I'll tell you is make noise because sometimes there are copperheads on the trail. But the reason I don't want to say go into the shallow water is there's enough push here to knock you over. If you get a foot stuck, it's it's extremely hazardous. Okay. I did um, get a foot stuck. I got lucky. Yeah. yeah. This yeah, is where people like, this is where people come to practice rescuing folks who get their foot stuck. That's what I did. Yeah, I got stuck there and he yeah. got stuck in between there. That's a that's that right there is like one of the most dangerous places on this section of the run. When you walk know. back up here, look for a metal canoe, and then you'll understand how lucky you've been. Okay. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> You're getting the hang of this roll. Right through the waves. Alright, follow me.
That was good.